Hi everyone, thank you so much for joining me. This is Kathy. I'm back with another reveal video and today I'll be sharing with you the Slimline Cornered Rectangles die set. I think that this is a super fun die set and it comes with six dies and they all have the corners notched off as well as some stitching detail around the edge. They're all a really very good size. The largest die measures eight and a half by three and a half inches. The second one measures eight by three. The next one is seven and a half by two and a half, then seven by two, six and a half by one and a half, and finally the smallest die measures six inches by one inch. Another thing that I really like about this die set is that they're really easy to line up so you can cut some open frames and layer them up in this manner and it would add just a lot of interest to a card. It would also be perfect for shaker cards. I do have a couple of samples to share with you. For my first sample, I used the second to largest die stamped directly on that panel and then adhered that to a piece of green cardstock that was just slightly larger. And for my second sample, I did some ink blending and emboss resist. And again, I used the second largest die and covered the front of the card with a whole bunch of words using the new Kitty Alphabet die set. And for my final card, I decided to make a shaped card using the dies. And I also created a frame to go around the outer edge using the largest die and the second largest die to frame in my stamped image and my die cut words. And that's it, that wraps up this reveal video. Thank you so much for joining me. For more information, I'll have that linked in the description box below for you. For more inspiration, head on over to the Whimsy Stamps blog. We'd love to have you follow us over on Instagram and join our Facebook group. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you've not yet subscribed, we'd love it if you would. And don't forget to ring the bell so you're notified every time a new video is posted. Thanks again, and we'll see you next time.